the Black Sea has seen a significant decrease in biodiversity. This is due to an invasive species called the sea walnut. The sea walnut was introduced to the Black Sea in the 1980s. It is originally from the Atlantic coast of North and South America. However, it was accidentally transported to the Black Sea by ballast water. Ballast water is water that is carried in ships ballast tanks to improve stability. The sea walnut has thrived in this new environment. This is due to it being a species which can easily adapt to new environments, as it does not need very specific requirements to live. Also, the sea walnut has no natural predators in the Black Sea, and it can rapidly reproduce without needing a mate. A single sea walnut can release up to 10,000 eggs. This leads to a rapid increase in sea walnut numbers in the Black Sea. Sea walnuts have thrived in the Black Sea so much that in the 1990s it was recorded that sea walnuts made up roughly 90% of biomass in the Black Sea. The introduction of sea walnuts to the Black Sea has led to the collapse of local fisheries. This is because both sea walnuts and commercial fish feed on zooplankton, so the sea walnuts provide competition for the fish that they didn't have before. Sea walnuts also feed on fish eggs and larvae. All of this leads to a reduction in fish numbers in the Black Sea. This reduction of fish leads to a reduction in larger organisms such as dolphins, as they have less food. Sea walnuts have also had environmental impacts on the ecosystem. For example, they have reduced the overall oxygen in the Black Sea and reduced the water transparency. This makes both respiration and photosynthesis harder for organisms in the Black Sea.